time to lock in today, really focus. Um, you know, just really play this like a tournament. It's time to give y'all a good match. Last week was not what I wanted. Let's focus, lock in, let's go. We're back with another Sunday set. Today we have Simon on the channel. Simon, how you feeling today? Good, man, how are you? I'm doing good, doing good. Um, tell us a little bit about your tennis background, how long you've been playing, you know, what level relatively you are. Yeah, man, so I've been playing about 10 years. Uh, started like 2014 as a bet with my friend. What was the bet? Uh, I just called it a girl sport. I knew he just wanted to go in because he had a crush there. Ah, so I was like, okay. I'm gonna go in. <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. I ended up falling in love with it and then yeah. just continued. I uh, played D3 and took a hiatus. Now I'm just trying to get back into it cool. little by little, see how far I can go. Do you have a UTR or USTA level right now? Ah, last time I checked, it was like a six something. Okay. Yeah. What was your high UTR when you played D3? Like seven or eight. Okay. Something like cool. that. Cool. Um, tell us a little bit about your racket setup. Right now I'm rocking the Pro Staff, not the RF. I got the RF over there, but I want to start with something light for now. Nice. And then if I feel better, then switch over to a heavier one. All right, so you're the guest. Would you like to serve or return first? I'll take side. I'll take that side. Okay. I will... I'll return first. Deep. I was not ready for that serve to be honest. Good ball. Out. Out. Not moving like I want to early. I'm not moving like I want to. I always play these like right after work. It's four o'clock. Had an absolute grind on the job today. So it's always tough to get ready to play. Out. Oh. Out. Out. Gosh. Hmm. Hmm. Out. Out. All right, so first set thoughts here. <sighs> Definitely. Tight, tight, but just need to get some more balls in, get used to the atmosphere. Do you feel nervous or no? Oh, for sure, yeah, I don't know. Do just... you feel no more nervous right now, or do you remember what you felt like during your college matches, which is? Dude, I feel a lot more nervous now. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Hell of a first set there. It's been called a game, Kyle. Game. You'll learn. Good ball. Gotta put more juice on that plus one. Gave it to him. Gotta lift the ball deeper.
two doubles, not ideal. I have not practiced serving in three weeks because of tennis elbow, but my tennis elbow is about gone, so it's time to get back at it. Out. Hey, good ball. We're both helping each other out a little too much early. Oh, what are you doing? Out deep. <sighs> Could have hit a normal backhand there. My thought was just to hit a lob. I don't know why. I'm sure, huh? <laughs> <laughs> What's going, what went wrong those last two games? Well, on the serve, that was terrible. I normally don't get broken without putting up a fight. I mean, two double faults, that's giving him a game. That's what went wrong. You're not looking like yourself there. I'm not? Uh-uh. Really? I didn't look like yourself, no. Should I look like myself here? <laughs> there he is. You see a one-hander, you attack a one-hander. See a one-hander, attack a one-hander. Design for a reason. All right, quick break in the action to shout out our sponsor, Direct Tennis. You probably know them as the people who hooks you up with your local stringers, but now they have a tennis shop. It's super easy. Just download the app at the link in the bio, go there, go to the tennis shop, find your racket of choice, enter the quantity, and then type in winners only in all caps in the discount code, and you get 10% off. It's that easy. You get a $269 racket, you're getting $27 off. Huge discount. So go check out Direct Tennis. The motto today was make balls. That's what we were talking about. Driving over here, he's just repeating it to himself over and over. Hey, good serve. Oh, my bad, my bad. Oh no. You can edit that out, right? <laughs> deep, deep. Out. Lose two, get you two right back. Lose two, get you two right back. Why don't we get me three? Why don't we get me three? Serve well. And it's a possibility. No way around that. Did y'all just see that attempt at a drop shot? I watched way too much Carlos Alcaraz than anything else. That was horrible.
Make balls, make these returns, put them in play. Out. Make balls, man, you gotta put it in play. What the hell is that? Just cause you have a lead don't mean you start ripping. Yoke. Out. Simon looks to be in his head, maybe a little bit. He's voiced his concerns about the camera. I wouldn't say it's done anything to change my life, except it's a lot of work behind it. A lot of hours editing and stuff. It's fun and I like trying to like get better at video editing and video production. So that's been, it's like, I like doing that. I like playing tennis, combine them both, but. Are you trying to do it like full time? Uh, hopefully one day, but we'll see. It's definitely made my life busier. I'll say that's the one thing that's changed. Winners only, just hit 10K. Hey, thank y'all for 10K. I don't want to be one of those guys just like, oh, it means so much. But I appreciate y'all watching the videos and subscribing. I have a lot of fun doing this. And it means a lot that, you know, a lot of people watch these Sunday sets every week. Like I haven't missed a Sunday set in a year and a half. So we're grinding, but let's try to get a win today. Why are you trying to take that so close to the line? Come on. Oh. Hey. Hmm. Ah. Stay in the rally, Jesus. Come on. Sorry, sorry. You hate to see it, but you love to see it at the same time. Kyle, how many double faults am I gonna hit? Gotta get back in the lab with that serve. It's just not cutting it today other than a few big ones. But it's still there to bail me out. It gives and it takes. It gives and it takes to serve. Hey. Hey. Come on.
Out. Out. It's honestly, I'd play worse in front of the camera, like as opposed to tournaments, because I'm like trying to talk and make the video interesting and like worried about camera setup and stuff. Because when I'm like playing a UTR match or a competitive match, I'm just like talking to myself like a maniac. Here, I'm like trying to, after a point, I like to explain what I did wrong or something. And that kind of takes you out of it a little bit. Not let him back in this shit. Now we're swinging through again. You can't start babying it. Out. That's a good experience. Yeah, yeah. That is a wrap on today's Sunday set. I got the dub 8-5. Um, Simon, how do you feel like today went? Uh, definitely need more camera and training experience. <laughs> yeah, the nerves were, were there today. Those are going crazy, man. I, I'm still shaking right now. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, that's tough. Yeah, I feel like both sides didn't play that great. I didn't, never felt like we got into really that many good rallies, so I didn't feel like I got into too good of a rally rhythm. Well, what was I trying to do? Because I had a, like a certain game plan that I was... I thought you were like really attacking my backhand. Yeah. Because, as you can tell, I wasn't really hitting it that deep. I mm -hmm. was making a lot of unforced errors. Yeah. In the back end. But I really liked your serves. You're really capitalizing on that one. But yeah, you're right. I was trying to hit to your backhand and <laughs> serve to your backhand most of the time. What do, you, what do you think my game plan was? What do you think? What were you trying to do? So my actual game plan was to just get it over. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's my game plan pretty much every time. So I, I can think about where I hit it serving, and then I, I'm trying to work on more like play cross court, play like proper way, but a lot of times it ends up being like, let's just get the ball back over. <laughs> but anyway, Simon, thanks for coming out. Yeah, man. It's thanks a good one today. Yeah, um, thank y'all for watching, winners only. Peace. See you guys.